Tip number six. Control description options. To add a control description on the map, you need to choose the control description symbol in the symbol box and a drawing tool. Then you can place the anchor on the map. For each anchor, you can choose if it should be a symbol control description or a text control description. And if the anchor is the top left or the bottom left. We now place for this example, the second control description anchor and choose the text option for this one. If we now activate the preview, then we can see both control descriptions. May we have the situation that the space is not big enough for the control description because it is too long. In that case, we have the possibility to go to the core setting options and to reduce the maximum length, for example, by defining the maximum length with 14 rows. In that case, the symbol control description will start a second column after 14 rows. There are more options about control description. For example, you can choose if some lines should be drawn thicker. You can also define the box size for the control description on the map, or if the control description should have a white background.